Nothing guarantees your database is reachable, or even online, but that won't stop others from trying to update it. In your concert app, a new event is added and organizers are tracking down sponsors. Once a deal is struck, the sponsor and their agreement is plugged into your database, although sometimes the network is down and the updates need to be sent several times before they're deemed successful. Not a big deal, it's saved to your computer and the system will periodically retry. For now, they just ask for their company logo on the concert page. Fifteen minutes later, the sponsor calls back, asking if they can put a banner at the event instead. Sure, what's the harm? You plug it into your database, and this time, the network's back online. We know the order of these updates since we watched them unfold. First it was a page logo, then it changed to a banner. That's why Gun attaches time to each update. While computer time is almost never accurate, it's often good enough for approximating. Regardless of order, we know which updates to keep simply by comparing update timestamps. Now as easy as all this sounds, there's more nuance. What happens if an update is applied with a timestamp two years in the future? Does it prevent other rights from being acknowledged? That's what we cover next in our video about relative time in GUN.